All right, listen up. I'm going to be blunt here. I don't have time for an intro. This is a serious question. I want to know how many of you have recorded your own gameplay to look back at it and see what you did wrong. Because that's what we're doing right now. So that's what I want to do today. I want to look back and see what we did wrong and what we did right. We got a 21, a 1, a 4, and a 58. A little intimidated by that 58. So I'm feeling a little, uh, you know, not so sure about this one. A little intimidated, right? But there's a level one in there, so that's cool. So as Spencer at level two, if you don't play this game, you don't know how it works, you just got to deal with the cards you've been dealt. And uh, those cards, those are your abilities. And they just kind of randomly come up and you play your hand. You can't customize your deck until level five. So you can see I popped my shield right there. Go that ahead, was stupid. <laughs> that was very stupid. Don't do that. Wait until you're being messed with or when you really think you're going to be and you're gearing up to shoot. Here's another stupid thing. That's an auto turret, folks. I'm not aiming that. That does its own thing. There's no reason for me to still be on this camera whatsoever. <laughs> Dropping zombies in front of people. Not a good idea. Unless you want them to get, you know, ammunition and uh, time. It's a good one. Drop them into an open room where they can easily dispatch of them if they wanted. That's a good thing to do, though. Shut doors. A child could so I've been spending that. far too long out in this stupid lobby. There's, there's just really no reason for that. But I've got someone in here. And if I was paying attention, I could have made a good move there to separate her and then gun her down. Did you see? My turret had just come up. But instead, I'm going to mess with this guy. And this is what Tyrone wants you to do, folks. Tyrone wants you to mess with him, and never mind the other three people that are gathering the objective. Tyrone's real good at that shit. So just keep that in mind. Tick tock, tick tock. Success for you. I would not be too pleased with I love these voice actors. Ooh, look at the doggo. Got a bit. Rocket doggo for the win, dude. I didn't even notice that the first time. I didn't even notice him do that. In the heat of the moment, I'm just like, hey, hey, what, hey, where's she, what's she doing? Ah. Seriously, like, that's what my head's thinking. Oh, oh, which, uh, because it's so much to take in. I don't, first of all, I should mention, I've played on this no, level like twice. She's, she's in trouble. Oh, aim there, buddy. Aim. Come on. Come on. Look at me playing like a newbie in SOCOM. Land the shots, kiddo. Look, watch what she does. She's, she's kind of in trouble, though. She left herself open. Oh, did you hear that? <laughs> Crunchy crunch. She got herself bit trying to avoid me. Uh-oh. So sad. That's so sad. And that's all it takes, really. So that's what you want to be doing with him. You want to wait for people to do some dumb stuff like that. And then capitalize on it. And when they do, just spawn a bunch of crap in there. Usually, I mean, I gotta be real with you. Typically, people don't use creature cards, like, at all with Spencer, I think. But I gotta use what I've got. And, and they're not going to get her. You know what's going through their heads right now, guys? You know. You've been there. I'm not going to get her. I'm not going to get her. Oh, I guess we're just gonna have to take the 30-second loss there. Yeah, we're not gonna win. Stupid randoms. Why don't I play with my friends? Oh, that's right, my friends don't play this game. I don't have any friends. <laughs> I got a queue by myself. What a cold and cruel world. As Spencer gets you down to 30 seconds and drops a landmine or a leg trap that was like a newbie. Don't do that. Don't just... Don't. And you're going to notice I do it again. Good. I make the same mistake. And I knew what I was doing when I was doing it. I'm like, don't do this. Don't do this. Uh, why'd you do that? But I still did it. Because you always think in your head, right? I might snare him. There's a chance. There's very little chance. So now the security guy's in here. I can't remember his name. You want to keep him safe. With Daniel, I'd be buffing him off. And, bah, buffing him off. Buffing him up. <laughs> And taking control of him. And that's going to lead to a spicy comment. All right, so my ultimate is up. Machine gun's ready to roll. 
And I've got two mod generators that I'm not entirely certain what are doing for me, but I know that they're regenerating things. <laughs> and I turn off the light. Whoops. Meant to get the door. Yeah, can't do that with a zombie. Where's Jan? Anybody see Jan? Can she do that through the wall? Somebody let me know, please. I don't see her anywhere. And watch, she does it again, too. That's her. But this is Becca right here. Sticking her gun out. That was her little action army thing or whatever. So, yeah, she got me, seemingly, through the wall. And I'm just scrambling, because I know I need this camera. I'm not going to switch. You could do that. You can, uh, you can mash the buttons and get the camera back faster. Newbie goes down. Splits herself off a bit. I know as Spencer, I just want to run the clock down. I probably should have taken control of this zombie here and tried to do something with him, but I don't know. Like, the Daniel in me says, control everything. But that's, that's really not how Spence works. Good old Spence. I love him. I think he's just awesome. He's a sinister old man. It's, I mean, it's just funny. I shall have to run the data again, or whatever he says. Now the creatures are starting to get a, a bit of a leg up here on them. I have so many ways. To but I'm making a lot of mistakes. I'm seeing them. That corner right there, man, that broke my chops. So finally, I realized, don't worry about that. She's gonna crawl away. But here comes the firefighter to save the day, man. He's got a shotgun, too. Tyrone, what are you doing? You're looking so good, man. Trap that up, trap that up before I lose my camera. Oh. All right, so they're going to be coming over here. Hey, look who it is. It's the newbie. And she's like, nope. <laughs> she noped right out of there. She's going for help. Come over here, see what's going on. Accidentally popped a shield or something? What the heck did I do there? I don't know. But they shot my camera out. Now, they can do, you don't have to be there. They can do that. And really good players are probably going to do that constantly and just keep you so you can't even see. Ooh, we got an IV in the deck now. If you don't have fire, those things are a nightmare to deal with. Now I'm, I realize I got a, an auto rifle here, so I'm going to set that up and boogie. Now I'm starting to understand how the auto rifles are working. Yeah, <laughs> it sounds like the grudge is just... Uh... I've got these two uh, mods in here. I'm thinking to myself, all right, they're nice, but I don't really have anything great here. And I don't want to get rid of my hand that can cycle my cards. So I just got rid of that. This was probably a mistake. But, hey. We got three creatures in here. One of them's an ivy. I've got the, the shield. And a turret. Or a gun ready to go. Popped that way too fast. Way too fast. I, that's a mistake that you're going to make a lot with him. Ooh, achievement. Yeah, and that, the pressure's on. If I knew what I was doing here, this would have been it. Honestly, the creatures are probably what got in the way there. Because it fed them time. So if they weren't in there and I just let them come in, maybe I could have locked the door and shot them. But Mostly want to be focusing on traps with him and guns. Can I get... Can I... Nope. Wouldn't let me do it. And for some reason, I, I think I popped my shield again. I know that I can get at least one of them. Should probably have saved it, but... Whatever. They could be shooting my camera right now, I believe. And she just stands there for a second. And then the gun finished the job. Finishes the job. Nice. Not bad. How did that get hacked? Okay, yeah. She didn't go down, right? She got hurt pretty bad, but didn't down her. And then again, look, there it is. Placing the mine like a goof. 
You get him so close, you just <laughs> you just want to finish it, you know. But with him, you are not sufficiently afraid yet. Don't. Very well. Don't rush Proceed it. Proceed to the next area. See what I can it's do. It's Spencer. You should savor it. The torture. <laughs> you should. You should want them to go through all three of these. Um, honestly, one of my strategies from now on, I think, is going to be just if they're losing in the first round, I'm not going to, I'm not going to just shut them down. I'm going to let them go because I've had that happen a lot where I just wreck them. And I'm looking, I don't know this map very well. You can tell. I'm struggling to find a camera where I should go to. Oh, okay. Here's the, uh, the bio weapon case. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> that's bad. Probably should have came in here a little bit earlier. Come on. She was about to open fire on me, and she could have got a good stun lock going. Got herself bit, and I capitalized on that. Now she's locked in here. But I've got 21 shots left, and I just noticed, oh, this thing's on a timer. Down in the bottom of the screen, you see that? Had to go. So let's just set up this turret rifle and move on. Oh, look, I got the clone rifle. How lucky was that? Might not be the best place to use it, but hey, why not? These guys are in a lot of trouble. It's over. And this right here, folks, this is my favorite part. Watching Jan fall down. Why are you not all dead? This will suffice for the time being, but I will have to run the <laughs> test again. You gotta got love that voice actor. Come on. People can say what they want about this game, but Spencer is awesome. So there you have it, guys. Let me know what you think about it. And if you want to see more of these, you want to see other masterminds and watch me grow. Um, yeah, again, I'm looking for people to let me know what I did wrong. That's part of the reason why I'm doing this, to watch it back and learn and to get some criticism. And at the same time, give people something to watch while we're all locked up, you know, aside from the birds outside my window. We're enjoying their freedom. I thank you all for watching, and I look forward to seeing you all in the next video.